One of the new foreign models is Rolanda Locke. This 28 years old lady came to Hanoi from Atlanta, America just a few weeks ago. She chose Tay Model Management Company, a local agency, as her representative. Well, I came to Vietnam about two weeks ago. Um, I originally came to Cambodia to do NGO work and being a model in America, I wanted to continue to do modeling here in Southeast Asia. So I contacted Alex and exchanged photos and we talked for a few months and set up a meeting and I came to Vietnam. According to Rolanda, if she worked as a promotion girl, she can get $100 an hour and for a catwalk show, she wouldn't receive $350. Compared with other countries, that is not a good pay. However, she still decided to stay here in Hanoi to work as a professional model. By its nature, this industry is very competitive. Um, but something that's different about Vietnam is that I feel like the models are friendlier, whereas um, the competition is a little bit it makes it more difficult to form friendships and people are competitive first. They're not, um, they're not friendly, they're not as you know, polite with other models, but that's not the case here and it's part of the reason why I actually love being here. Many foreign models see Vietnam as a stepping stone in their career, a place to get experience before they enter the major fashion centers in the region like Shanghai in China or the Philippines. In Taiwan, Hong Kong, or in Europe, a professional model can earn 800 to 1,000 US dollar from an appearance in a catwalk show, 15,000 to 25,000 US dollar for starring in a televised advertisement. I have to say honestly, I much prefer working with the models that I've met here in, in Vietnam than. Um, than, than the models that I would typically be working with in London. I think in London, um, it's 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 so competitive. It's kind of a quite a frustrating um, business. There's lots of um, being put on option for shows as a reserve, and you find out the day whether or not you're going to actually be there. So I I think um, models are so busy trying to compete, they don't have the time to be sociable and and have fun and just enjoy what they're doing. According to Thomas, young models come to Asian countries like Vietnam to build up a portfolio and to gain experience on the catwalks. The pay is definitely not as good as in the developed countries. He added, however, that developing countries are good destination for an international model to start a career. <laughs>